The time has come. I've been getting requests about this in the comments for months. People want me to return to console rust and check it out. So, without further ado, today is the day. Now, I do have one day of console rust experience. I didn't want to completely jump into this blindsided and not know anything. So I decided to jump on a day before the wipe just to practice. It went horrendously badly. I tried to build a rock base and I got online raided in the first two hours. So with that being said, we're going to be jumping straight onto a fresh wipe server today, playing solo. I'm equipped with one day of console experience. So let's see how this goes. Enjoy. Okay, guys, welcome back. Day number two. Uh, I'm going to try and take everything I've learned over the past uh, few days and see if we can uh, do any better this time on consoles. So we got raided, online raided last night, um, which is was fun. Apparently, I didn't realize this, but the server wiped. Yeah, it was Thursday yesterday, and I thought it was a monthly server, but no, apparently not. It wiped yesterday. So today, all the servers are freshly wiped. So I'm thinking we start fresh, see if we can do any better than we did yesterday. Now, I do want to build a rock base again. That's the plan. So we'll stick to the theme of getting a rock base built. And we'll stick to the goal of trying to take oil rig just to finish the video off. Right, let's jump on then. EU Bones LC. It's got 53 players on and it's only 9am. So I imagine the server's going to get pretty busy later. This time around, I will try and make this less painful for you guys to watch. It does take a bit of getting used to on the control pad. It really does. Because again, like... When we were being on right, uh, when we were being when we were being online raided yesterday, I uh, I kept pressing this down, which is the gesture menu, as you guys saw, and that's just gonna take some getting used to of not doing that. But all right, we spawned in. Here we are. Let's have a look at the map, see how it looks. Looks pretty good to me. Well, we're in the desert. We spawned out here, so we're gonna find a rock to build on, and we'll go from there. Oh, look at all these stone nodes that have very nicely spawned right off the beach for us. There's an island over there as well. An island that actually has a rock on it. And a rather big base. Let's go and investigate that. We might live on there. A rock island base. Okay. Uh, I'm being tormented by a wolf. Right. This is a really cool island. It's got a, a rock. A couple of rocks on there. And the oil rig is over there. Right. So, small oil rig. Island. Rock base. Let me loot all the barrels up and recycle. Oh, crap player. Friendly, please. Hello. Okay, okay, okay. Listen, we can talk about this. Do you have a microphone? At the very least. Okay, we'll fight then. We'll fight. No, we won't. Well, we won't. Wait, 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 wait. I'm getting out. Oh my god, he killed me. You absolute. Please bear with me. You guys are either going to really find this video funny or extremely hard to watch. Because when it comes to PvP on a control pad, I don't even know how to describe what I am. How far away did we spawn? Not too far. We'll run up there now. Let's go. Right, I farmed up some resources. Um, it's getting night. I'm going to hide next to a rock or something. Maybe this one here. And then when it gets to morning, we'll go over to the island and start building. I've found up a decent amount of resources. I've got the tool cupboard. I've got some doors and locks crafting. I like the fact that we're playing on a fresh server now, though. It's going to make the whole experience more legit. You know, if we want to get the true Rust console experience, we've got to start on a fresh wipe. As you can see, there's quite a few bases here. I'm hoping they're not all allied. We've got like a little village going on or something. It, it looks like mostly two by ones and then a, a slightly bigger base there. Because this would be a great island for a clan. They've got oil rig over there, so they'd probably love it. Right, we're on the island. Need to wait to get for it to get a bit more day so I can see what I'm doing. But there's lots of nodes on here, which is a great sign. I think the main problem we'll have is wood, but I'll, uh, you know, you can't have everything in this game. You know, we'll deal with it. And then uh, oil rig over there. Found a few more stone nodes. Hopefully none of these bases are active right now because it's early in the morning. Okay, can I can I get some more sunlight so I can see what the freaking I'm doing? This side of the rock looks great. And it's not facing all the groups on the island. So we can be a little bit discreet and have our rock base on this side so nobody can see us. I think I'm pretty set on just building the base right here on this rock. Have our tool cupboard right here. And then obviously we'll have this honeycombed like this so that people can't um okay that's a slight problem well it's not really uh, it, whatever well let me build there but right well whatever that's fine we'll have the honeycomb in there 
Okay, I like the pattern that we've got right here. It's very good. Uh, let's begin building this. And locks on. Hey, you know what? I'm I'm getting a uh, I'm getting pretty quick with this controller thing. Look at this. The speed. Okay, right. Just right, forget that just happened. Okay, destroy that. Alright, th watch this for speed, okay? Watch this. <sighs> Bam. Bam. There we go. It's harder than it looks. Depot all of this in there. And all we need to do to organize it, once again, I'm obsessed with this, but all we need to do is that, and it organizes it for us. Okay, let's make a little trip over to the lighthouse, and we'll get all the barrels, and we will recycle everything, and hopefully that'll give us enough metal just to get a sheet metal door down, so that we're at least uh, safe from eco raids. I'll have a little closer look at some of the other bases on here. We've got this guy, solo player. Oh no, never mind, code lock, right? Possibly a duo then. So these are the top guys on the island. There is a ladder on the base though. Does that mean they've been raided? Okay, I don't know how you jumped up there, but there you go. Player asleep in this base. Another code lock. Oh my god. The wolves. There's a player here. There's a player inside, but I need to heal up before we can go in and try and kill him. Got no cloth, so I can't craft the bandage because I'm bleeding right now. Now, this is where you get to see my console PvP skills in action. Enjoy. This guy has nothing, but I'm, I'm trying my uh, spear skills here. Run into that. Can I, can I aim this at him? Oh my god, he got it. He got it. Oh my god, I'm... Bloody hell, I'm awful! Yeah, it's not a pretty sight, but get used to it. <laughs> it's a full video of this. Right, back over here. Right, here we are again. Spear in hand. Let's get the lighthouse looted then like I originally planned. Player. Oh, you want to fight? You want to fight, huh? I'm friendly, I'm friendly. Hey, you see that? See that? One more hit and you're dead. You need to hit me loads, bro. Wait, friendly. Oh, I'm getting out of here. Hey, listen, I'm I'm new to console. Take it easy on me, bro. Me too. Really? You wanted the smoke. No, I didn't. I didn't want no smoke. Yeah, I'm brand new to this. Uh, me too. Oh, there's a crap old guy here. Let's let's him up. Don't deal with oh. It was nice knowing you lost and alone. I'm getting used. I've, I've, you've got to give me a, a chance to just get the hang of it. It's the, using the jo joystick. There are going to be a lot of deaths today. Look, we respawned right at the island, so that's good. Get a spear. Maybe get a hatchet. And once again, uh, you know what? I'm going to stop. Instead of looting the lighthouse like I just planned, let's just loot a bit of the road. Crap. There's a player in that furnace base. Oh my god. Jesus. We are dead. Oh, he's close. He's as close to me. If I can get to the fishing village. Yes, we're in the safe zone. Get wrecked, Tazzy guy. Okay, how much have we got? We've got 12 low grade. Wrap. Off. Yeah, now. Okay, I spawned on the island. Let's see if our base is still uh, around. Because I did see a couple people running on here. But we are quite well hidden. I just hate having a wooden door because it just makes us so easy to raid. Uh, okay, no, we're still we're still here. Right, craft some tools. Since we're here now, craft some tools. Let's uh, let's go to the lighthouse and try and try and loot it. Ah, try and loot it. God damn it. We got really lucky when we came here for the first time because there was even, there was a green key card and everything. Ah! Classic. How long have you been sat in there for, Joker X? You absolute... Well, uh, right, forget about the lighthouse because little Joey in there is having a bit of fun. Right, almost back at the lighthouse now. Back to our home. I'll just wait for this first bag to craft before I make the swim over to our island. I mean, I say, I say our island. Right, sleeping bag. Bang that down. Good stuff. We've still not been raided. Nice little hidden spot here. All right, depot everything we just got. Press this simple button to organize it all. There we go. 
Um, and we've got 96 scrap. We don't have enough metal to craft the, the door. But we do have enough metal to craft a large box. So we're going to split that wood like so. Take 500. Boom. Get the box down. Good stuff. And just depot. I, I don't even need to... I can, I can depot everything. And then like you guys have seen, I can just press one button to organize it. There we go. And I'll take this metal back. Right. I'm going to risk it. I'm going to go and recycle some of the, this sheet metal and the tarp. I'm going to go recycle it at the lighthouse. And if that guy's still camping it, then fair play to him. I'm going to recycle one metal pipe. I want to save the metal pipes for when we come to craft revolvers, which will be very soon because we've already got enough of the tier one. So uh, let's get another sleeping bag placed down next to our base. And we've got the components to recycle. So... Let's just get... In fact, should we craft a spear? I'm thinking, is there any point? Because I'm pretty useless with it. But we'll craft a spear. Why not? All right. No new bases on the island. It's just me and these guys. You never know. They might be friendly. It might be a friendly island. We'll have to wait and see when they log in. Okay. We are back. There are no barrels here. Hello there. Goodbye. How you doing today, sir? Do you have a microphone? I can't hear you. I, I can't hear you, mate. But how you doing? I'm not going to attack him. He's got nothing. He just said hello to me in the local chat. I'm just here to recycle. So, if, you know, feel free to grab anything you need. Just have a look. You can see right here, there's, there's an active base. with a, the, the guy over there, he's got a gun. Um, and there's also a furnace base over there, which is active. Pretty big base. So, there's a lot going on in this area. And then we've got our beautiful little island here. Grab all that. We've got a 200 metal. That's enough, of course. So let's get that home right now. Crap, I'm hearing a player with a hazzy. I'm, I'm dead. You get way more oxygen on console, but I am dead. No way I'm surviving this. I'm being followed by a guy that has some kind of gun. Oh, I'm, I'm dead because he's going to stand up now. Yeah, he's, he's over there. I'm swimming really slowly. I'm standing up now. 35 health. Problem with console, I, I mean, I've already just said this, but the hitbox is massive. So you can't really zigzag like you can on PC. I think I managed to escape the crossbow guy. He went the other way. Okay, good. 200 metal. And let's craft that metal door right now. Crossbow guy is chasing. Metal door is being crafted. Let's take off this lock. All right. Sheet metal door is down. Lock is on. Okay, we're a little bit safer now. Right, it's night time, so I'm I'm in need of a, a cup of tea, I think. A nice little uh, re relaxing break from them getting killed over and over again. Hopefully soon we can start to pick up the momentum and get some crossbows and stuff like that. And, and uh, you know, just try and get some PvP. Like, I want to get some kills and stuff. But ambitious, innit? We, we, we've got this. Okay, I'm going to take advantage of all the driftwood that's on this island and take it all before everyone logs on that lives on the island just grab it all now there's a player outside the base i don't know what he's doing he's dropping stuff oh it's a naked oh okay okay i just died let's see if we can spawn in a bag and see if he goes in one of the bases i think there's a new base that's being built see that base there on the rock the rock that we are literally building on. Right, well, he's just... He's got a cross... There he is. There he is, the bloody... Where does he live? I, I want to see where he goes. Does he live in that base? Let's see if we can see him go inside. He's farming. He's farming all the nodes. I'm going to TC grief him. I don't like the fact he's that close to me. Right, we're going to have to be really quick with this. It's all covered griefing. Just get this as close as we can. That will do. A little bit of a tool cupboard grief. That's as close as I could get it. I don't know if the guy that killed me is the guy that lives here. Because he did. I didn't see him go back inside. So, ah, that guy that just killed us. Um, he, he took all the nodes on the island. No, no, no. I see a guy there farming with a rock. Hang on a minute. No, that's not. That's the, the bloody crossbow guy again. Farming on here. Right, we're going to spy on him. He's not farming with it. Let's see where he goes. Is he going in that base? Ah, yes, there we go. Right, well, we've met one of the guys on the island. It's a pleasure making an acquaintance with you. The crossbow guy could be worse. 
Could have a gun. He's only got a crossbow. Right, well, let's go farm nodes on the mainland since we're not getting anything on here at the minute, this guy there. But as soon as we've got a crossbow down, I'm going to try and kill him. Okay, I made it back with some farm. Let's craft a hatchet and go and get some wood and uh, go and get some barrels and some rope so that we can craft some crossbows. Hello, my friends. How you doing today, sir? Where are we going, lads? There's so many people running around the island. Seen two players to the left there. They appear to be naked. It's really hard to tell from a distance. Because actually, the island is a freshborn location. I've, I've obviously before we spawned on here as a freshborn. So, yeah, you can spawn on the island. So, we'll be expecting some freshborns. I'll tell you what, though. There's 100 people on this server now. And 100 people on this uh, on console feels like a lot more. I'm enjoying myself at the moment. Albeit, the aiming situation needs some improvement. Sugarcoat it. <laughs> I do need to work on that. Overall, I mean, I'm, I'm enjoying it. It's not too hectic, but there's still lots of players that you're running into, you know? Made it back. I have managed to get some decent loot there. 37 low grade and some animal fat. Um, we do have some cloth in this box, I believe. Yes, we do. Right then, furnace. Let's get him placed right here. Furnace on. <laughs> Come on, boys. What is with this? What is with this sensitivity? This is... This is shocking. There we go. Right, the sensitivity might need to be changed a bit. Okay, I just managed to get an Ioka. We'll take that. Oh my god. I'm gonna check... Yeah, I'm gonna change the sensitivity again. Because it, it's so slow closing my door and stuff. We'll go up to... 34%. Alright, that feels better. Like, if I'm trying to get somebody. Yeah, that, that's probably better. Okay. Got him. Kill the guy that had a bow, lads. Oh, and I was using my tools. I'm getting, I'm making progress. We have a bow. I might actually start to get better at the game now. I think the sensitivity is just about right now. Let me drop a bunch of stuff real quick. All right, I'm just out farming again. A bit more, just in the process of upgrading the base. So just going to get a few more stone nodes and uh, get back over to the island. It's a nice little kill that. 50%, um, how's that? It still feels not great. I need to change something else. Okay, that feels better. Let's go. Let's go. That's really good. No, that's a lot better. Right. There's a player on the island. He stood still. Well, he kind of looks like he's got nothing. <laughs> See if we can go for a long shot. Hey. Hey. There we go. He was a fresh ball, wasn't he? Sorry, Raz. I had to practice my aim. Okay, I'm back at the rock with a little bit of stone. But yeah, anyway, here's our rock. As you can see, starting to blend into the actual rock. Um, and we made it. Boom. With a bow. Okay. Deposit everything and organize it all. There's a guy on a boat. Okay. I'm going to go around the island real quick. See if there's any more stone nodes. And then I'll continue base upgrading.
after upgrading the base a little bit, we were once again acquainted with our neighbors. These guys definitely like to sit on their roof. In fact, they've even started building a tower on the other rock. Don't know if I just got spotted or not. I need some driftwood real quick. Just a little bit. That'll do. Oh, yeah, I can see them going up to their rock base now. There's a guy on the rock base there. Say hello to Flavio. This is one of the guys that lives inside of the base on the other side of the island. So far, these are the only people we've met. But one thing's for sure, they are definitely our enemies. We'll be seeing a lot more of Flavio this wipe. For now though, we need to make sure our base is as secure as it can be. We're not welcome on this island, so the base needs fortifying as much as possible. Now, whilst I was minding my own business, I realized that there was a slight issue with this rock base, a small gap beside the rock. Unfortunately, I was not able to patch up. It was not letting me build a wall or a ceiling to cover this small gap. And well, Flavio and his crew found out about this little gap that I had and figured out that they could destroy my tool cupboard by shooting through the gap and potentially grief my base. They fired shotgun round after shotgun round. Meanwhile, I was nervous as a wreck, spamming the place button on my tool cupboard so that as soon as they destroyed the TC, I could place another one down before they do. If they're able to place a tool cupboard before me, they can grief my base entirely and stop me from entering it. Lucky for me, they stopped firing for a brief period of time, I'm assuming to craft more ammo, and I was able to repair the tool cupboard. Also lucky for me, another group showed up and started shooting shooting at Flavio and his crew. Now the only thing we can do to fix this and to prevent us from being griefed is to move the tool cupboard. So... Oh my god, thank god I got that down boys. I was bloody crap in it. Surprised they didn't come back, you know? Because, uh, yeah, they could have just destroyed my tool cupboard and then griefed my front door and stopped me from getting in and out of my base. Um, so, that's lucky we got it. So, we've replaced the tool cupboard in this room. And we can't do anything about this gap. It is what it is. I'm building blocked, I'm, apparently. I'm too close to the base that's on the other side of the rock. So, right then. I'm getting some sleep, me lads. I'm getting some sleep. I've done some base upgrade, and I'll show you what I've done right now. And this is where I'm going to leave the base. Because um, I'm trying to stick to a schedule where I go to sleep at the same time. And I'm not losing sleep for rust anymore because I think my health is more important. On that note, I am going to leave the base like this right now. As you guys can see, I've done some honeycombing. Whole of this side of the base is honeycombed and the top and we've got like metal in the ceiling as well. But this is what the base looks like right now in the rock cliff. So uh, it's, it's taking shape and let's just hope that those guys over there you know what? I think they might have logged out. They might have the same idea as me. I mean, it is a English, it is a British server, should I say? A lot of the people on here are from England, so uh, they might be thinking, "Hey, we're just gonna get to bed. Screw this guy's tool cupboard." So hopefully, yeah. We've got 11 hours on the TC. I'm leaving it there. I progressed quite slowly today because I was more so figuring things out, and uh, 
it's getting used to it. But tomorrow, we'll get the workbench down, we'll research the revolver, and we'll start getting the key cards and stuff and getting prepared to take oil rig. So, yes, overall, first day um, on this server. Had a bit of fun on it and managed to get the start of our rock base. So let's bring on day number two tomorrow. Hopefully we don't get raided. I feel like we've been raided, you know. Oh! We haven't... We survived! Fellas! Wonderful. Nobody's bloody raided us. Okay, let's see how the island has changed overnight let's get it uh my neighbors upgraded his base a little bit this was the guy that was in the two by two uh, that base has decayed which was the furnace bait that's weird that how's that decayed one of his doors is open and there's already people <laughs> running around here <laughs> so this furnace base is gone right they've upgraded their base a little bit they're a bit bigger bonjour way friendly man Oh! No! Okay, let's get some crossbows crafted. Craft four of them. Let's see if we can make some uh, plays with this. From what I've noticed, the crossbow seems to be an item that a lot of people use. So it's possibly the meta when it comes to prim uh, on console. Because I see more people using it than Revolver, even. Let's eat some food and try it out, then. New base being built right there. Um, assuming it belongs to the guy that lives here. Oh, look. They're building a giant compound thing. I guess they're planning on putting a tool cu cupboard here. There's a player there. Yeah, that's got to be... I don't know who that is. I could ruin this guy, these guys and put a tool cupboard down and ruin their day. Crossbow fight, here we go. Hit him once. Killed him. Boom. Gotta be quick before his mate comes out. Oh, it's Flavio. We all know Flavio. Good old Flavio, good to see you, mate. Good little crossbow fight. You get the hang of it? It's basically about strafing on console rather than actually aiming down the site. And the, the hitbox is so massive on console that he's going to know who killed him. He's probably going to come outside my base in a minute. Okay, let's be very annoying and let's craft a tool cupboard right now. I'm an asshole for this. Sue me. Do I have a building plan and hammer already crafted? Let's see. Uh, no, I don't. Okay, we'll craft that then. And there's the base. That we're about to sort of grief. I saw the eyes of the maker heard a rushing sound. Caught up in the wheel going round and Oh my god, I've done it. I've done it. <laughs> oh my god, I'm such a bad person. He was trying to tool come and stack his base. Now you can't. <laughs> I see a player over there running to the lighthouse. Oh, look at that for a shot. Oh, so close. Get in your base, mate. Yeah, he's, he's just made it in. Little Flavio. Good to see you, mate. There he is. So I wonder who lives in, in this, because that's obviously their main base. So who lives in this base? Bonjour, my friend. Hit him once. I think I've, I think I've got a gun. Double barrel. Oh, loads of wood. Oh, he must be the guy that's building that base then. Like we thought. So Flavio lives on the other side of the island. And then we've got this fella who uh, I'll just deposit the double barrel because that's quite good. So it's nearly broken, but we'll research it. Right. Well, the guy that lives next to us, he he's not part of Flavio's crew. He's separate, right? And he's trying to build his main base now. And I, that's the base I've just griefed. In a way, I mean, I've not completely griefed it. I've just stopped him from being able to tool cupboard stack. So I've kind of ruined his base design. I've not had... Look, this guy's not been friendly. I tried talking to him. He's knocked on the door. Bonjour! That was a... That was a crazy shot. 
Oh, uh -huh, dude, you're my neighbor, right? See, I tried talking to you, but uh, yeah. I live. Oh, I can't hear you. Uh, are you? Let me ask you a question. Are you trying to build a new base? Is your base the one yeah. with the garage doors? Yeah. Okay, well, I've just griefed you, so yeah, let, yeah, let, that's let my base. I, I, I need to not grief you. Wait, I need a hammer. Come with me. Pass me a hammer, because I've just griefed you, and I feel really bad. Come with me. Come with me, because I thought you were an asshole, but you seem pretty cool. Yeah, yo, that was the crazy shot ever. <laughs> really? Yeah, I'm, I'm actually from PC, mate, but I, uh, I'm yo. trying console for the first time today. Well, for the second time, just for fun. I just opened the door and that arrow came right in. Boom. <laughs> right, let me let me stop. Hang on. Let me quickly. I've, we, we're in. What the fuck? That was crazy. So you're planning on uh, tool cupboard stacking here, right? You're going to put a tool cupboard here? Yeah. Okay, well, look at this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, do you want to use that instead, or do you want me to destroy the whole thing? Uh, you know what? I'm trying to build, but I don't know who the hell keeps coming. We've been getting camped all night. All night we were getting camped. Dude, those guys over there are so, so I don't annoying. Even know if I should... Yeah, Flavio, his name is. Yeah, there's two of them, right? Two or three, yeah. Um, and they don't. They they, they sit on their roof yeah. a lot with and stuff. Yeah. I just need I just need to make the TCs that way. Okay. Okay, well listen, I'm gonna destroy this whole thing because I know you're you're planning on putting a tool cupboard here, which is what works for the base design. So I'll destroy this. Yeah. And then you can put a tool cupboard, but do you have access to this as well? Is this your base? Or was this not? Yeah. Yeah. No, this this was not. I don't know whose base this was. Okay, well uh it's that I was, that's why I didn't put the I didn't put the tool cover because I've been waiting for this to be caved. Ah, it's at 88. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Fair. Right. Well. Uh, steady. Awesome, mate. I'm your neighbor, and I'll, I'll, uh, I'll, I'll be friendly and stuff like that. And me and you against these guys, bro. We gotta, we gotta try and take them out at some point. Gotcha. <laughs> yeah, we're plan, we we're, we're planning on raiding them, but my guys, uh, they're, they're, they're different time zone than me. Ah, right. Okay. So yeah. So I'm up later than they are. Okay. Yeah. Fair. Um, well, do you want your double barrel back? Because I was going to research it, but if you want it back, I can give it you back. Oh, no, you can research it. You can go ahead. We haven't researched it. Okay, hell yeah. All right, That's well, the only one we got. I'll see you around, Steady. No, no. I wasn't going to ask. Yeah, yeah. I wasn't going to ask for it back. I was just going to tell you that was a crazy shot. <laughs> Thank you, man. <laughs> it's all about strafing on console, I've noticed. It's all <laughs> yeah, about yeah. doing this kind of thing uh, with when you aim. But yeah, yeah. yeah. I I seen that because you were running by and all you did was look and the, and next thing you know the arrow hit me and I was like what the hell? <laughs> all right, well uh, I'll get cracking on on doing my yeah, thing. I didn't, and I didn't even see you. Yeah. I'll uh, I'll see you around, steady. Gotcha. Yeah, man. Gotcha. All right, brother. What? We made an alliance, lads. <laughs> this is like the perfect Jordan Rats video. I'm living. I'm building a rock base on an island and we've just made an alliance. Oh yeah. He's gonna want his wood back. Uh, sweaty, I'm dropping the wood that I took from you outside your base. It's outside your front door. I see a player running over there. He's quite far away. We do have a decent amount of loot on us, but I'll chase him. See if we can get a shot. He's over there. I think he's just looting barrels and stuff. Going along the road. He's going to have some stuff on him, this guy. Don't tell me he lives in that massive clan base. No way. He does. Right, we'll head back to the satellite. I want to recycle the stuff that we just uh, got. From hitting barrels. Oh, that, yeah, no, that's a clan base. There we go. That's the boys we can see from our island. Hopefully they're not online right now, but... Um, right, let's get over to the lighthouse, to the island. We've got 128 scrap in our inventory and uh, 270 cloth, so get that depot. 
Seems like the only guy that's online from the enemies on our island, that base, you can see right in front, is uh, Flavio. He's the guy that's online the most, I've noticed. And then his mate, later on, his, his mates come on. And I, and I think there's there's two or, or three. So it's it's not too bad. It, yep. And the, these were the guys that tried to grief us last night. Get rid of our tool cupboard. He's, he's out of his base again, look. He's Flavio, I just saw him run. He's, he looks like he's running towards... Where's he going? Lighthouse, maybe? Yeah, lighthouse to recycle. But he's naked. He just leaves the base naked. I know he's got guns, but maybe he's the, the guy in the team that, like, is needs permission to take a gun out. <laughs> he's got to wait for his mates to come on later. Should I just try and kill him anyway? With the 128 scrap I've got. I could, Nah, I'll get... Oh, crap. Nope, there's a guy with a gun. Yeah, let's get, let's get back to base real quick. I, I do... I th actually, yeah, Flavio... His teammates are online. There is... Just saw an extra one then. So, yeah, there's two now. Okay, made it back for night time. Perfect timing. Let's see. Open tech tree. Let's go. Okay. Bit more work to do. Look at this guy on his roof. Look at him. Having a little fun over there on your roof, mate. Oh, he's only got a rock. Fresh spawn. Yes. It's hard to tell. It's hard to see. Uh, like. Oh. I'm sorry. How are you today? Friendly? See you later, bro. Hey, there's a river over there. Go get some food. Heal up. Oh, he's still on his roof. Our, our wonderful neighbors. Um, right, I'm approaching the rock now. I'm going to show you guys what's going on with our base at the moment. So, I've not changed pretty much anything since last night. I just patched up the top of the base and uh, honeycombed the base and whatever. So, here's a tour. Walk through. We've got a bed right there, which I just placed down. Then we go through these doors. Quite a few sheet metal doors, all wrapped around. There's a little drop box there, which I've placed. But all these doors wrap around like so until we get here. We've got one furnace down. One box right there with some loot in. And then this door. Again, another box and our tool cupboard. And then at the back of the base, this is where the tool cupboard used to be. But of course, we've realized there's a gap there that you can shoot through. This is what we kind of got down here. It's uh, my tool cupboard and furnace. I might move the other furnace down here as well. It's not the coziest of bases. You know, it's doing the job. We'll, have to, we'll make it a lot more homely once we've electrified it. And everything like that. I'm just going to organize that. We now have 94 scraps. So we're trying to collect a little bit more so we can research the revolver. And to be fair, I might just try and go and do oil rig with a revolver. If I'm honest with you. So once we've got that researched, we can head over there and, and do the oil rig. And then with the, if we do the oil rig successfully, it doesn't seem like there's many people taking it. I'm seeing the locked crate there quite often. Whether it's just too hard on console, I did see some tweets about it being pretty tricky on console. Now, there's your base tour. Not much to see at the moment. Uh, but I am going to just quickly see. We've got a green key card. So why don't we go and get a blue one? Let's go. We'll go over to the harbor and good stuff. Oh, I've already got a few in my inventory. Fair. Oh my god, I do not want to get in one of these fights again. It's a task and a half. Getting into melee, melee uh, almost getting destroyed in a rock fight, even though I had a hatchet, when we need to be focusing on harbor and getting the blue key card. Okay, we're here. Okay, fuse, get that in there. Perfect. Right. Bam. Good stuff. Grab the loot. Uh, one box. Okay. I'll take that. Right. Got the blue key card. Good. Take the fuse out. And back home. Oh, there is an airdrop landing. Oh, do we risk the blue key card? We can get a green and a blue again. Okay. Let's uh, scout this out then. See if there's anybody. Yep. Couple of players. Hit him once. Oh. Take your airdrop. Take your airdrop. Take it. <laughs> Player in front as well. He's also going to the airdrop. Uh, <laughs> how are you both doing today? Yo, yo, I can't lie. We have nothing. We got raided like, literally like an hour ago. 
Oh, unlucky. Where did you live? Did you live around here? No, I, I lived um, over near Thingy, our outpost. And then I had, I have, I had peace and stuff. And then, yeah, I got raided when I was sleeping, so. Oh, uh, you're starting again then? You're going all over again? Yeah, like, oh, I only have one VP and that's called Reggie though, so, yeah, I, I'm not doing the greatest, but it's still something Make I Make a play, bro, you got this. See you later. Yeah, alright, thank you. I mean, I mean, I don't know why he's thanking me, I couldn't, I, I couldn't have killed him or anything, we're in the safe zone. Okay, just recycle all this. Right, I've got some bad news and some, well, bad news. Any plan that I may have had to take over this island and raid my neighbors has probably come to an end because they have upgraded their base and it's now a giant block of stone, which I, I don't think I'd be able to raid, to be honest, if I'm looking at that. Me as a little solo on this island, unless I get some serious help from my neighbors, but they, although they've upgraded their base, my neighbor friend guy has done zero upgrading. <laughs> And it's still a little tiny base. So, yeah. These guys are... I'm going to just say they've probably got control of this island at this point. And I'm expecting to get raided at some point. So, with that being said, we need to hurry up and do the oil rig before that happens. We only need, uh, let's see, 20, 75, 95, 170 scrap. And then we'll have the revolver. Perfect. Right then. Just 170 scrap, then I'll go and do one more run, and then we can go and continue trying to get the red key card. Look at those guys. My lord. The only hope that we have of taking over our island right here is if these big clan boys raid these guys. Which, uh, definitely, I'd be worried. If I was these guys, I'd be definitely worried about that. <laughs> They've been running oil rig a lot. They've got two big boats outside the base. 139 scrap. Well, we need 31 scrap then, and we'll, uh... We'll be good. Back to base with that, depot it, and then we'll just hit a few barrels. Revolver is researched. Let's craft a few of those. Crafting 500 gunpowder now. Oh. On the outside. Bonjour, mon ami. Did I be on? What's happening, boys? Hello, mate. Where are you from? W w what base? Hello, mate. What base are you from? Are you from the big clan base? Uh, we're over in C3. Oh sh! Wait. C5, C5, C5. Oh, your C5. base is massive. Okay, spare my, spare me, please. Do not yeah. raid me. <laughs> hey, listen. If you could raid never... my neighbors, no, bro, I'm not, I'm just... if you could raid my neighbors on the island, please do it. The big base over near Lighthouse. Yeah, they're dick. Are they dead? Yeah, they're dickheads. They're tormenting the solo players on here. Uh, are these all solo bases around here? Well, there's me and then there's the guy next to me to the uh, to the south of where I am now. He's he's a solo guy. He's... Southeast. Yeah, he's an American dude. He's pretty cool. What's his name? Oh, sh**. Uh, I can't remember, mate, but he was a cool guy. No doubt. You have any problems, just come to C5. Uh, and then tell him that uh, I sent you. All right, bro. Yeah. Yeah. Take it easy, man. So, but yeah, maybe maybe we do try taking a swing at him. But yeah, it's really easy. <laughs> oh, my God. Hey, bro, boys, Rust is about freaking making connections with your neighbors okay i don't care if i've just told a clan to raid those guys that's the only hope i've got of raiding them so sue me <laughs> oh crap player players two players to the left do they spot me i don't think they well i hope not okay there we go we have enough radiation i hope those guys that are saw jumping don't come in the airfield oi, oi, oi. come on lads let's just get that red key card i just heard something possibly a player has the switch been activated? Don't think it has. All right. Fuse is going in. Switch is going on. Let's go. We have a lot of pumpkins to heal up, so hopefully that'll be all right. Get the green key card ready. Did I bring a torch with me? I didn't bring a torch with me. It's okay. It's just like straight down here. Oh, you can kind of see. See that? You can kind of see where you're going, which is good. Right. Here we go. Crap, I'm stuck. 
me out of there real quick. Okay, I'll go back in in a minute. Bandage up, get to full health. And then we'll go back in. We'll slap, we've got time on the timer. Ah, oh, I died. Ah, it's so hard, man. It's so hard to, to aim and shoot on this. Aim with the controller. <laughs> it's like, it feels almost impossible. I don't know how people do it. God damn. You guys, are any console players watching this, please let me know in the comments. Like, if there's any settings that I need to change or something to make it easier to aim. Or whether I just suck. <laughs> Here we are. Am I hearing scientists? I don't know if I am. Yep. That's a good sign. Alright, killed him. Nice. There's my body. All the loot's still there. Nice. Let's get that on. Drop that, drop that. Yep. Okay, that was a bit tricky. Killed him. Right, I'm getting the freaking hang of this now. If you got for me. Incendiary, it's all good. Here we go, lads. We've got an extra fuse, yep. One more scientist, then we can grab all the loot and get out of here. And get that red key card. I'm going to heal up to full. Two, three, four. Let's drop all the rubbish that we don't need. Because we're going to need inventory space, so. Right, here we go. Fuse is going in. One scientist to go. And then we've got this. Won't let me reload my gun for some reason. Why won't it let me reload my gun? Pistol bullets is fine. Let me reload my gun. Thank you. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die again! How do you play console? Fuse is in, switch is on. I hope you guys are enjoying watching me uh, fail badly on console, but... Oh, another fuse, perfect. Things will improve, all right? Things will improve. Right, here we go, I can hear the scientist again. Down. Medical syringe. Nice. I'm not taking any risks. I'm not losing it again. No way. We've got loads of cloth, so we're not going to risk anything. Got him. All right. One more scientist to go. Uh, another med. Nice. We'll just try and get as many hits as we can on him to begin with. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna take the fuse out. I'm gonna heal up to full, and then we'll go in again. Taking our time, man, because I am not going through the rigmarole of having to farm everything again. Fuse in. Got him. Oh, yes. We did it. Oh. Ah. <laughs> oh, my God. All right, just got to take your time with it. That's all it is. Take your time and you'll be good. Extra metal pipes. Nice. SMG body. Nice. There we go. Diving tank. I don't really care about, but I'll grab that anyway. Maybe we can die. If we want to be safe, we can just dive home. Uh, scientist had an extra med on him. Perfect. Extra fuse bullets as well. Right, then the most important item of all, of course, is the red key card. Grabbed that. Right, I've grabbed all the loot. I've not missed anything. Uh, that all the any boxes you see are just boxes that I've left loot inside, like that one. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's absolutely get out of here. I got an achievement for grabbing a red key card. Very nice. All right, let's find my way out of here. Okay, I just got one of these, which is perfect. Okay, can see what I'm doing now. <sighs> we made it back. Sorry that took me so long. I'm getting the hang of aiming a little bit with the joypad. 
but it's uh, tricky. We need a roof, lads. We need a we need a roof. That guy came out of nowhere. It's okay, I only lost a revolver. We've got loads of mal pipes. Where are you running to? Oh, I'm just trying to look for some wood and cloth so I can jump into that big compound over there. Uh oh, okay. Wait, what? Which one? The one on the island? The one opposite from us. Ah, uh, I don't think you'll find anything in there, but yeah. I think the top of the base yeah. is just uh do you have any wood you could spare? Any wood? Uh, nah, dude, there's no wood on this island. You'll have to go to mainland. But there is driftwood on the ground. Hey, you sound... I just wanted to say you sound really familiar. Like, I don't know, but I, I swear I've heard your voice somewhere. <laughs> well, uh, I actually... I actually am a rusty tuber. I usually play PC. I usually play PC, but I've come to check out console mm -hmm. for a little bit. It's pretty boring. It's uh, it's not bad. I'm having, I'm having a bit of a blast. It's all right. The PVP is bad because it's like aiming on here. It's is... not terrible. Yeah. It's not terrible, but uh, <laughs> it's, it's really bad. <laughs> yeah, it's messed up. Really messed up. <laughs> Mickey, are you not gonna stick up for okay, your console? Okay, well, um, what's your channel then? I'll check <laughs> you out. Uh, Jordan Rants. It's pretty. It's it's Mikey. It's it's Mikey. Mikey, Mikey. Yeah, stop yo. Stop lying there, bro. Just, just stop. You, I, yeah, bro. I can't tell if you're lying to me or something. Like, bro, you sound like it, but I can't like. You're the first person on console that's actually bro. recognized my voice. <laughs> so I'm like, and the oh, name sh just. <laughs> well, I can hear it, bro. Yeah, man. Well, have you got anything you want to say to the the viewers? Not really. Oh, there's two players on the island over there. I'm gonna go jump them. Record this. They both naked. They're both naked. I won. Oh yes. Go on, lad. Very nice. There we go. Damn, he has a has. He has a hazmat if you want it. Oh hell yeah! Thank you. Well, look. If if you want to live on the right, island, feel to, free. But if not, then here. I'll Come see you around. To... Mikey, legend. All right, I'll let you know. All right, dude. Yeah. All right, I'll see you. I'll, I'll be around. Here. All right. I'll be around. Oh, some shots behind me. Tommy, over here. It's all happening at the train yard. Right here he is. Kill him. Gotta heal up. It's not a Sar, it's a Tommy. Oh! <laughs> So many dead bodies out there. Should have been more patient, shouldn't I? It's all about patience. Movement's a lot slower on, on consoles, so. Now, after dying right here, I decided to take a little break from Rust for a few hours and go climbing. And uh, when I returned, things changed big time on the island. But first, we've got to wait for the queue. Right, lads. I had to take a bit of a break. There's 20 players ahead of me in this queue. It's a 100-player server, so... People are not going to be leaving, but as soon as I get back in the game, provided we've not been raided, we'll continue this, what we were doing. <laughs> right, I've just logged in. I wasn't even online, offline for that long, to be honest with you. And the island's changed a lot. My neighbor's base has decayed. These were the friendly guys, right? Um, there's basically a tier two in there that I want to grab. Turns out the big base on the island actually got raided. Um, the whole base is decaying now, but I just noticed that it was in fact raided from the top down. Because all the doors are gone uh, from the inner core. All the doors are gone here. And then they've griefed it by adding this thing here. So, um, so I've basically just got to say one thing. We're the only people left on the island. I am the only person that exists here now. Oh, crap. 
There's a guy on the island with a bloody Tommy. You bet he's here for that tier two, you know. I see all the boats coming over to the bloody island. Player there, yeah, there he is, Tommy. Yeah, they'll be trying to get through that tier two, I know it. Right, we're through the tool cupboard. Is there any loot? Oh, there is. Crap, there's a player. Oh my god, he's got he's yeah, he's got a gun. I'm gonna die. Oh, they're, dead. they're gonna get the oh, they got the tier two. No! I'm tempted just to go to sleep. Come back tomorrow, finish the base upgrading and do the oil rig then. <sighs> it's bloody annoying, man. Would have been great to kill them. Alright, well we're gonna go off for the night. Come back for day three tomorrow. Good sir. Yo, we're chill, we're chill. Men of chill, the night. I'm chill. I'm chill. We're chill. Please. We're chill. Okay. Thank you, boys. Hola, mate. How you doing, lads? Is, no, you're good. You're good. Look, he's he's my teammate. Hell I'm yeah. Where are you from? Where do you guys live? Australia. No, no, I mean like what base? <laughs> yeah, that that one over there. They got raided. Oh, I, I met your teammate yesterday. Uh, he's really cool. Yeah, I spoke to him. He, uh, we, we became friends. Yeah. Hell yeah. Yeah, he's right there. Oh, sh your mic's not working steady. Yeah. Oh, you boys are back then. What happened? Were you online when they raided you? Yeah. One of our, one of our teammates. Or like a hatchet. I got a hatchet. You need a hatchet? Yeah, yeah. Yes, sir. All right. Hang on, boys. Uh, let me see. Hatchet. Hang on. D -d 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 I'm pretty poor. I'm not gonna lie. I'm pretty poor. Um. Oh, hey, I've got something better than a hatchet, boys. Take this. Hang on. Okay, yeah, take this, lads. Um. Oh. Thank you, sir. Oh yeah. Are you guys building back on the island, or are you gonna go live somewhere else? No, we're building back on the island. Hell yeah. yeah. They put... No, we're building here. Hell yeah. All right, well, uh, good to see you, lads. Good to see you back. Get that. See you later. They're coming back. I'm not alone on the island. Now, the first thing we're going to do on this final day is finish the rock base. Electrify it, add a shooting floor, and build a little chimney so we've got access to the top of the rock. Alright ladies and gentlemen, the base is complete and my neighbours have upgraded their base a lot as well. Um, so alright, 
this is my console rock base. This is basically where I'm going to leave the base at. I'm not going to upgrade it much more than this because I want to um, move the focus towards doing a raid and then finishing it off with oil rig. So this is the base right now. As you can see, I'll give you a little pan around the rock a bit here. And then we'll go inside and I'll give you a tour of it inside. All the twig you can see needs to be destroyed because that was placed by those guys, which lived over on the other side of the island. Oh, we all know what happened to them. So there you go. There's the rock from the outside. Let's take a look inside. Welcome, everybody. So right off the bat, we have a window here where we can enjoy the nice view of the ocean right there. And uh, we can also see if there's any door campers and stuff. We've got two trade windows right here. Um, and then follow me through. We have this section right here. There's a light up there. And then if you go upstairs, we have a bunch of windows up here. This is the shooting floor in case I need to defend the rock base. I can use this right here. Um, so, yeah, you know, does the job. again, I can also enjoy the view if I want to do that. Through here, we've got a couple drop boxes. These are just the boxes that I picked up from the um, decaying base that I found earlier. Or the raided base. Uh, three boxes I have there. Mostly just drop boxes, those. And then if we go upstairs, we've got another light there. This is our uh, electrical room. We've got the large battery. And then also we have a tower right here that we can go all the way up like so. And we can get quick access to the top of the rock. If we need to get on top of this rock to shoot anybody that might be on the island or help my neighbors out who are over there, then we can do that. Um, and as you can see, my neighbor's upgrading his base right now. There's that. Uh, they also have a furnace base there. So we're the only people left on the island. Me and these duo right here. And they're both really cool guys. Let's go down into the core of the base and I'll show you that right now. And then through here, another light. Loads of sheet metal doors. Just going through these all wrap round. Uh, we have another drop box here. Again, another light. Some exposed rock right there. Through here. We're going to go straight through, and this takes you into the core of the base. We have a grand total of two boxes <laughs> one and three furnaces. Tool cupboards right there. And then once again, we have the exposed rock theme coming in again with the furnace room and the workbench right there, right at the back of the base. All right, everyone. So we've completed step one of three. We finished the base. Now it's time to go and do our first console raid. I'm just going to be completely honest with you here. This goes horrendously bad. So I just want you to enjoy the rage that occurs and the extremely bad play on my behalf. And we'll just try and forget about this. So uh, I saw a base that was out in the snow while I was out farming there that was built on an iceberg. I thought it looked really interesting. So that's the base we're going to raid. And uh, this raid doesn't last very long, but enjoy. Here we go then. You know the old saying, if we die, we die. Let's get it. Satchel raid. Jump over there. Yeah, it's going to be through the doors. Right, here we go, guys. Let's do this. One, two, two explosions. Come on, give me good explosions. Two more. One. Right, we're through. It's all open. Uh, oh, well, we're doing. Okay, I got a bit too excited there. There was the. Okay, where's the TC? TC's gonna be through this door. Talk about open. We can craft a single door instead of a double door. Oh my god, there's sulfur. It won't let me place a door down. I don't know why. But wooden door's about to be crafted anyway. It won't let me place a door. I'm not I'm not authorized. Now I'm authorized. Doors down. No! I'm gesturing! I'm gesturing, I'm gesturing, I'm gesturing, I'm gesturing, oh, why, why is that a thing, why is that a thing, somebody tell me, oh, why is that a thing, oh my god, I'm shaking, ah, there's no way to change it. Thing, why have you got gestures on what the, the thing you use to aim? Okay, wait, maybe I can change it. I don't know. Yeah, I'm seeing it on Reddit. People talk about it. Disable quick chat. Is that going to be what it is? Yes, I've disabled it. 
Right, for those who want to know how to do that, um, go to uh, d -d 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 go to controls and input preferences, disable quick chat, enable that. Yeah, there you go. I've done it now. All right, well, that was fun, wasn't it? Now, as you guys can probably imagine, oil rig did not go very well either. There was already somebody on the oil rig, and I did make my best effort to try and counter it and take the guy out. But uh, he destroyed me. You know what? There's some really, really good console Rust players. Because playing on a control pad with that joystick is, is something else. On that note, this is where today's video will end. So thank you for watching. Um, this was highly requested. Play console. And I will definitely return to console um, every now and then just to sort of check it out. And just enjoy it because it's a, definitely a more stripped down version of Rust. But in a weird way, I kind of like that at the same time. So the island is in safe hands. Our alliance duo have upgraded their base immensely. They now have walls around it. And I'm sure they will take good care of the island. So on that note, enjoy the rest of your week, everyone. And uh, I will see you in the next one. Take it easy. Peace out.